Hey everybody, you are watching tutorials. My name is Alex and in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to design this editable doodle effect in Adobe Illustrator. So let's start with a new document, Ctrl N or Command N on your Mac to bring up a new document panel and I'm working with the custom size, uh, 1800 pixels of width and 9 80 of height so click create to bring up a new canvas and on the new canvas grab the text tool or type tool as it's called in adobe illustrator and uh, set doodle in all capitals you can choose of course your word okay i'm uh, working with the doodle and i want to go to the character panel if you can find your character panel go to the windows uh, character type Windows car type character or click Ctrl T Command T on your canvas. Okay, on this car car character panel, I want to first set the text size, the first field on top left. Uh, I want to set it on 300 points. Then I want to work with the, the type itself. I want to find uh, the typeface that is called KB Planet. KB Planet Earth. So this typeface is free for both and personal and I believe commercial use. You can check the link in the description to download this font. So within this KB planet, let's go and uh, add a new field first of all. So bring up the appearance panel, go into Windows appearance of Shift F6. I want to undock this appearance panel to focus on it unclearly and if you can take a look on this bottom left uh, corner so here we have add new fill add new strokes this is what we need to do in your uh, under appearance panel so click first uh, add a new fill add a new stroke keep your stroke selected go to the color picker and select this rgb blue this icon just RGB blue and I want to advance my stroke I want to boost it uh, and increasing the stroke weight to around 15 points that's all for stroke for now let's go to the field I want to bring up the color pick again and uh, change it to white okay so let's select the stroke again this stroke this blue stroke and go to the effect uh, effect gallery and under effect gallery I want to go to this folder brush strokes and uh, within this brush strokes folder I want to change navigate to spray stroke this effect and this spray stroke shows us this uh, doodling spray uh, kind of stroke effect and uh, this is exactly what I need I even don't bother with the parameters I want to leave everything with the default stroke length to 12 spray radius to 7 click ok ok that's fine let's select a field and bring up another field and select the field on rear this bottom uh, guy and uh, I want to bring up again the color picker and select the RGB blue ok so we are working with the bottom uh, bottom field it's important I want to go to the effect distort and transform transform this with the ellipses and bring up the transform effect the dialog box in this dialog box i want to work with the horizontal move and vertical move value this text field so put the uh, cursor under the text fields and start typing negative 25 points uh, on under horizontal move and positive 20 pixels under the vertical move check preview it should push your stroke under the bottom left and click OK. And now we need to keep it selected, this uh, field. I'm sorry, not stroke, the field, of course. And uh, head over again to the effect. This time we are working with the stylize and scribble with the ellipses. Uh, this brings up us a uh, scribble dialog box and uh, here i want to set the angle to 42 degrees i believe the angle um, here uh, by default is 30 uh, change it to 30, uh, 42 then go to the uh, stroke uh, the variation set it to 3 pixels stroke width to 5 pixels curviness to 4 points uh, 4 per percent variation to 6 percent spacing to 5 per, per pixels and variation 
another type of variation as you can see we have three types of variation and so bottom type of variations is 11 pixels so check preview click ok you will see there is this is how you can create this doodle effect and finally let's uh, kind of like pack it in graphic style uh, bring up the graphic style panel go to the windows graphic style shift f5 um, uh, under the graphic style navigate to bottom right corner find this icon new graphic style keep selected your design and click on this graphic style panel it will give you this icon then you can save it uh, save graphic style you can delete everything and save only this icon if you want to uh, minimize your graphic style panel you can also download this on the vitorials.net so that's easy now how to use this graphic style you can create any shape let's say i am gonna walk with the star and apply this graphic style to it uh, within the single click and if you want to learn more tips on how to boost your adobe illustrator proficiency and uh, create this ready-made design with graphic styles with this uh, with the symbols with the scripts with the uh, actions uh, check my course uh, on udemy uh, how to be more proficient in adobe illustrator i hope you can learn something from this course as well okay thank you for watching don't forget to visit tutorials.net for more adobe illustrator and graphic designer tutorials share this tutorial with your friend and as always, enjoy your day.